Hello guys, welcome to my YouTube channel. In this video, we'll try to fix this problem. It's kind of very annoying when you edit your video. Filmora, it's a great editing software, but sometimes it happens and we have some problems. But don't worry, I'll try my best to help you in uh, this video. I can't guarantee you, but this will work. But I'll try my best and share with you what I tried in the past and it worked for me, okay? So this is from my personal experience and what worked for me i'll share with you so now without further ado let's jump right into the video also if you're new to my YouTube channel make sure you subscribe i really appreciate it okay so what you have to do and what i did to fix this problem is go to graphics because somehow there was a problem with uh with the graphics so i look for i look in this list and you should find Wonder Share Filmora 12 or 11 and click on option and here is very important make sure you select high performance okay so your computer will use your GPU instead of letting windows to decide uh, which GPU or not GPU but maybe it's in power saving well that's what windows will decide and your computer or laptop will run very slow so make sure you're doing this and now also and windows updates and not only updating your windows not not necessarily what i'm trying to show you here is it's good to update your windows that's 100 percent but i also like to click on advanced options here and here you should see a bunch of updates if you click on optional updates here you should see driver updates there's four listed but usually there's 20 if you haven't done this already or it's been a long time since you checked driver updates it's gonna see a long list so make sure you check this this is gonna help you fix this problem and as well as also what i tried and i'm sure this is what actually fixed the problem but i'm still going to share with you is it's pretty important if you actually um you should see here in help okay help if you click on help you help here you should see check for updates click on check for updates and usually maybe it's just a bug or something like that but um yeah it's important to do this as well uh if you're more it's up to date so it's up to date for me but maybe you, there's a new version available for you so make sure you're doing that and also a tip for you what i like to do when i'm editing any in any software i always love learning skills and trying new editing softwares i've tried a bunch of softwares like uh, CopCut, it any almost any any editing software you can imagine not all of them obviously but i that's what i like to do and what i learned if you don't want the black screen make also make sure you save the project with, with control s or just um we're just clicking here right just click on save project uh usually that might happen when you when you're doing this okay so uh, yeah that's the video guys let me know uh, in the comment section if you still have this problem i hope this video helped you fix the problem because i really understand how annoying it is so thank you guys for watching and make sure you don't forget to subscribe for more tutorials so thank you and uh, take care guys take care and i'll see you in the next video